It's the holiday shopping season, and that means everyone is on the hunt for the perfect gifts. Welcome to a brand new episode of Go. I'm your host, Danny Giesbrecht, and today we're here at the Butterdome Craft Sale looking for those great, unique gift ideas. We're going to be chatting about what local vendors are offering up this time of year, like these very unique, cool wreaths. Believe it or not, the woman behind these creations have, has only been creating them for about three months now. We're going to learn her story and talk to some other local artists on today's show. Stay tuned for all of that, but up first, Shot TV's Tim Danzi takes us to the Edmonton Food Bank. From the Edmonton Food Bank to the downtown core, up next, Shot TV's Bianca Jade learns about the harsh reality for homeless youth here in our city. All right, we are now here with Adriana and her line of homemade wreaths. Now, I find this very interesting because you only started making these wreaths three or four months ago. Yes, that's exactly. Three or four months ago, myself and my business partner, Emma, we decided that Edmonton needed new uh, wreaths with different colors, different style, modern, uh -huh. using different materials, and here we are. And how do you make one of these? Well, this is uh, our actually signature wreath. It's called canela. All our wreaths have names. Mm -hmm. Canela in Spanish means, um, um, oh, sorry, uh, cinnamon. Okay. And uh, it's made with uh, styrofoam inside. We uh, put, um, this is yarn, and we use felt. And all these little flowers that you see, they are made by hand one at a time. We cut the circles, glue them on, put uh, pins on, and it takes a long time, but lots of love. Lots of love. And where can people find these online? We have an online store. It's petalosontheroad.com. Excellent. Adriana, thanks so much for your Thank time. You. Stay Thank tuned. You. More coming up after this. Welcome back to the show. If you're just tuning in now, we are once again on location at the Butterdome Craft Sale, tracking down some unique gift ideas for those people that are hard to shop for on your list. And coming up at the show, we're going to be speaking with the ladies of Crocodile, a local watch brand made right here in Edmonton. And they're very cool watches out of deer hide leather. Stay tuned. We're going to be hearing about the inspiration behind their unique items. But first, Shanti B's Jordan Hertner is on location with the United Way, learning about coats for kids. Thanks for that, Jordan. Okay, if you're really looking for something super unique, then you can't get more unique than a one-of-a-kind watch and bonus made right here in Edmonton. We're going to be speaking with one of the creators, Carly Kendrew, coming up in the show of Croc and Dial. Stay tuned for that. But first, most kids nowadays are gaming before they can even walk or talk, and it's an ever-evolving world. Up next, volunteer reporter Sarah King explores what's new in the trends of gaming. All right, we are now here with Carly Kendrew of this cool brand of watches made right here in Edmonton, Croc and Dial. You created this brand with your sister. Where did it all begin? It began after a trip in Australia. We seen lots of cuffs and we just wanted them fashionable, like fashion and function. So we came home and bought like old coats, old skirts and put them together. And uh, it's just kind of grown from there. Now we have our own supplier that makes our watch faces and... We've got suppliers from the states that give us scraps. And yeah, you were telling me that you, you it's almost like Christmas in a box. It's a big surprise of colorful leather that you um, you, you take, and, you, and you're never sure where you're going to go with it, but each new watch is totally unique. Yeah, they're all totally unique and one of a kind. It's better than Christmas, getting that <laughs> box. It's all scraps, all remnants, so we never know what's coming. And it's just so fun to design them and you know that somebody's going to like something because they're all different, they're all unique and nobody else is going to have your watch. Excellent. Awesome. And what's your website so people can find you online? Uh, Crocondial.com. It's as easy as that. There we go. Thank you so much, Carly. Stay yeah. tuned after the break. We are switching locations. We'll be downtown at Flock Boutique. And we're back and we've switched locations. We are no longer at the Butter Dome. We're now on 124th Street and Jasper Ave at Flock Boutique. They have a very special men's shopping night coming up this Thursday. Now it is a women's boutique, but they're making things easy for all the men out there who have a lady to shop for. We're going to be chatting about it with Shalane coming up in just a moment, but quickly, what's big for some easy stocking stuffers for the woman on your list? Uh, cashmere is really hot. Beautiful blouses 
mittens with colorful beading this year and cozy finger mittens. There are so many different mittens that you can get for the lady on your list. And as we all know, we always like to accessorize with whatever we're wearing or whatever our mood is that day. So you can never have too many pairs of warm accessories, whether it's scarves, earmuffs, or mitts. Stay tuned. We're going to be chatting about all of that in just a moment. But first, we learn how a local musician is using his talents to support Alberta Avenue. All right, we are now here with Shalane of Flock Boutique, and we have some super fun gift ideas for all the men out there. Now, I like this. It's coming up this Thursday. You have a men's shopping night. Um, I know that shopping for anyone on my list can be super intimidating, but when you're a man shopping for the lady in your life, it's really sometimes awesome. it's difficult. So what's happening? So our men's night is this Thursday, and actually we're coming in for a little bit more of a relaxed date. Um, we're going to close down this door for you men and um, have pizza and beer and you can leave with some amazing presents. Um, so we have a little bit more of like a luxe look coming on and we just want to have something a little bit more special for your partners or your spouses and uh, have some fun with it too. Okay, so uh, what is hot for, um, let's start with stocking stuffers. These are easy. We've got some toques and some mitts on the table, some nice bright fuchsia colors and some Definitely. leather items. Yeah, so again, going back to that little special quality, we want something a little bit more upscale so like I said those beadings a little bit more fur or faux fur leather details and again with I mean you can't be flock without color <laughs> now jewelry sometimes can be difficult because you want to be able to buy something that's gonna please your lady uh, and you want to make sure you're getting the taste that she appreciates as well so when you're buying jewelry set like some of these beautiful bracelets you have yeah. what would you suggest as a man shopping for a woman I say keep it simple, keep it classic. You don't want to go overboard with jewelry. It's it's hard to please every woman out there. Um, but if you keep it classic and detailed orientated, I think it's a lot easier. And when you're buying blouses and stuff like that, what kind of advice would you give as a professional, yeah. especially a man shopping for a woman? You don't necessarily want to go like this <laughs> tag right before you leave either. No, and you know what? That's why we're here to help. Um, we have a lot of amazing women that support us and they can come in and bring their list in with us okay. um, and so leave they it. can leave a list yes. before Thursday yes. and then say hey honey just yeah. so you know pizza That's and beer at Flock Boutique yeah. if you want to stop by I also left left a list with my sizes on it exactly um, and I mean even if she didn't we know our, our people very well um, we can help him with the sizes and the styles and whatnot it's it's pretty easy once you get in here excellent <laughs> this Thursday pizza and beer men's night here at Flock Boutique Shalane thanks so much for your time thank you before we go here's your on the go calendar all right, we are just wrapping up, but one more reminder, if you are looking to shop for the lady on your list, come down to Flock Boutique this Thursday for their men's night. All the men out there, I'm sure if you wanted to bring your girlfriend, that's okay as well, but there will be pizza and beer, and you can leave a list to make it really easy. For more information, check them out on Facebook, Flock Boutique in Edmonton. I've been your host, Dana Giesbrecht. We'll see you next time.